so for my site specific installation i was originally going to do it at seattle u but my flight got changed to an earlier time so um, i had to do it at home and so for my research um, and inspiration um, i looked at um, books and bookshelves because i've seen some pieces where the artist would use um, the space in between those books uh, to create um, some sort of scene or town um, so I thought it would be cool to kind of experiment with that idea and before this I had um, I was going towards a more naturey kind of vibe so um, I kind of implemented that into my project as well with the birds um, and I thought it would be kind of a cool um, contradiction to um, whatever the shelves would be holding. So I decided to look at birds, um, and birds are known to be very resourceful, so um, I thought that would be interesting showing them in this kind of setting. Um, for my development, I decided to um, use a CD shelf that I have at home um, as my site. And um, I wanted to kind of show um, the bird, the birds um, in that um, enclosure, and um, yeah. So for my site, um, again, I used my CD shelf in my house, and um, there's a variety of music in those shelves, and. Um, it's just all the CDs that my parents have collected over the years. Um, and the lighting is from uh, light bulbs on the ceiling as well as natural light coming from the windows. For my objects, I decided to go with an origami, um, with origami. Um, to convey birds and um, my CD shelves and CDs. I also made um, a nest-like object with um, my origami paper. For my light sources, um, the existing light was um, the ceiling light, but this was not used in also natural light, and some light did come through, but not very little, uh, but very little. Um, and the added light I used uh, was um, a headlight, which um, gave off a cooler, stronger LED light, and then a flashlight, which gave off a warmer LED light. And then I also used another um, phone flashlight. So this was my setup, and um, I just thought it would be it was cool to space them out, and um, I tried a couple different um, setups, but I chose this one because I just liked um, the compositional element of it, and I feel like it also gives off a um, um, a message. Um, because you can kind of see here that um, the baby bird in the nest is kind of trapped and um, is um, cut off from its mother or another bird, which is um, which are um, um, on the top uh, CDs, top of the CDs, um, and I think this has a lot of meaning towards it. Uh, yes. So the, these were my first um, two pictures, and um, I just really like these because of the um, reflection the CDs gave off, um, and the way it lit up the birds, um, especially the um, the um, rightmost bird. Uh, these were my second. A uh, couple of photos 
and I really like this because it was a lot closer and a lot more intimate with the site and um, it just shows a lot more detail and shadow than the other ones did and it's a lot less exposed with light. The This is my next couple of photos um, and um, this time they're at different angles and I just thought this was cool because um, the lighting is um, a down light so you can kind of see that the shadow of the CDs, they kind of block off um, any light that comes that would come down onto the um, baby bird. Um, and it kind of creates a um, kind of ominous vibe towards it. And um, my next couple photos um, is from a side angle camera position and I thought this was also cool because again it gave off um, another ominous vibe but um, at a different angle because um, you can see that the CDs are leading to somewhere but you don't know where they're leading to or wh when it's going to end and I thought that was pretty cool and um, this time the light was um, a direct front light and you can see but it was um, a direct front light, um, mostly on the baby bird, so you couldn't see the um, the two other birds as well. And then my last photos, um, I thought these were the most interesting, and I liked these ones the best um, because of the focus of the light. It kind of creates a focal point towards just that one shelf, and. Um, I think it's really cool the way the um, light reflects off just a certain spot of on the um, on the CDs, and yeah, it just um, brings the um, the focus and the um, audience's eye to the center of that picture, and so. I thought that most of these pictures worked pretty well, but um, it was it was really hard to um, to find diff a variety of pictures to shoot from, or a different a variety of angles to shoot from, and um, it was hard to create like variety, um, but. I tried to use um, mostly um, contrasting CD colors to the blue birds to make them pop out more, which I thought really worked because you can clearly see um, the blue bir the blue birds. Um, and um, I discovered that it takes a lot of time and it takes a lot of thinking to um, make a type of installation like this. And um, the more meaning there is to it, uh, the better outcome you're going to get. And thank you for watching.